Big Hero 6 level has now been officially revealed for Kingdom Hearts 3. What other worlds would I like to see in Kingdom Hearts 3? Welcome to Press X. The Jungle Book is a world many people have been asking for since the original Kingdom Hearts. For this reason alone, I have a strong suspicion that we will see a Jungle Book level in Kingdom Hearts 3. Kingdom Hearts is known for having tons of those classic Disney movies like The Little Mermaid, Snow White, Sleeping Beauty. Where is the Jungle Book in all this? I feel like it's a bare necessity to have the Jungle Book as the level in Kingdom Hearts 3. Yep. Based off the worlds that have been revealed so far, it seems like they're using a lot of newer Disney movies. Which is fine with me, but if they're going to keep on this path, I'd like to see Wreck-It Ralph. This world is perfect. It's already a video game based world, so it's kind of meta. Imagine going into a level where there's a whole bunch of other video game characters, similar to how Traverse Town works. You'd have Final Fantasy, you'd have Disney, and then you'd just have other video game characters along for the ride. If this was something like Kingdom Hearts 2, I would say you could go into this world and do a bunch of mini-games pertaining to the world you went to in the Wreck-It Ralph movie. But after seeing the scale of the levels in Kingdom Hearts 3, I think you could really make them all mini-worlds that you go visit. I could also see it be a giant chase scene where you're going through these different games with brief cameos by all these game characters. The ideas are endless. The Princess and the Frog, a level based on voodoo? Sign me up! This is a classic story that got the Disney treatment back in 2009, and I think it went under the radar. This would be a good way to get the movie a little more exposure, and maybe reintroduce it to some people. The art style to this movie alone, I think grants it a spot, similar to how the Mulan level in Kingdom Hearts 2 was stylized to fit that one's movie with the effects and everything, I feel like this could be done the same way. Disney princesses are a huge part of the lore for Kingdom Hearts, so it makes sense to fit in the world for the princess and the frog. Imagine a world similar to that of Lion King, where the main characters are transformed into animals. And then it all ends with a fight versus the villain, one of the best Disney villains ever, the Shadow Man. That's too perfect! My next choice is Disney's Pixar. Now, I made this all one world because otherwise this would just be a top five Pixar list. So, and also there hasn't been a Pixar world just yet in these games. So it wouldn't surprise me if there isn't one at all and I don't wanna waste all of them. So this one slot's dedicated to all the Pixar movies. So we have amazing, amazing choices. We have Toy Story, we have Monsters, Inc. We have Inside Out, we have Brave. We have Cars. We have The Incredibles. We have Up. There's tons of choices to choose from. Heck, the Inside Out level could have you in the minds of one of the characters, and in the end, reveal something huge about the series that was a secret the whole time. Maybe an alternate motive. Especially with how the graphics look this time. They could make it identical to one of the Pixar movies. With how stingy Pixar is about giving out their properties, now that they could get it almost using the models from the movie, they don't have much to be worried about anymore. So I can't say enough about the different Pixar movies and how the worlds will work, but just picture a Toy Story or Incredibles world and I think you're on board. Before I get to my number one, I want to talk about some worlds that I don't want to see. First off, I don't want to see a Star Wars world. Uh, I know they did the Pirates of the Caribbean in the last one and that was done really well, but unless they have some sort of awesome idea, I don't think a Star Wars world will work. Though I wouldn't mind a cameo, maybe a boss fight with Darth Vader that gives you some sort of Keyblade lightsaber or something like that. I also don't want to see a Marvel world. This one I definitely don't want to see, whereas I feel like you could work Star Wars into it. I don't think you could fit Marvel at all. I think it would feel very out of place. People would start nitpicking things from the movies and how come this and it takes place in our world and all this stuff. Uh, I think it's way too complicated. Big Hero 6 is technically a Marvel property, but it's not part of the MCU. So I just say no to anything from the MCU. So my number one choice is actually Tangled, because it's my favorite Disney movie in recent years. 
but since that was already taken to my delight, I'm gonna have to go with Frozen. Now I'm almost confident this world will be in the game, I actually thought this was the world they were gonna reveal at the D23 event this year. I could picture it now, a beautiful world. You're either on Anna's side, looking for Elsa, or you're possibly on Elsa's side, helping her get out of trouble on her journey. I do think this is going to be their big reveal whenever they slap the date on it. I think they're going to say, here's a trailer for the Frozen World and here's the release date, which I don't expect anytime soon. So like this video and share it with your friends. And let me know in the comments down below what world you would like to see in Kingdom Hearts 3. And what world would you like to return to that we've already seen before? My personal choice would be the Nightmare Before Christmas level. I loved it in 1 and I loved it in 2 and I would like to see more of that world. Anyway, I'm Kevin McManus, and I'll speak with you next time.